How's it going guys? Jono here, your boy for the Review Brew. And I'm going to be handling the fitness, diet and training section of Review Brew right. And today we're talking about protein. So today we're reviewing whey protein. There we go. Blue Lab by USN. 100% premium whey. Bar one flavor. You can get this at specials at pharmacies. You can buy one, get one free. <laughs> you know what I mean? Anyway, so we're talking about whey protein and what pro whey protein is all about. And uh, well, protein is like a good source of energy, you know? Like one gram of protein is equivalent to four calories. Same as carbohydrates. But we want to try to stay away from carbs, eh? Carbs is all right, but sometimes it's bad for you. It bloats you up, bro. So, and also you got fats with uh, one gram of fats equivalent to nine calories. It's got a count your calories, which we will be talking about in later episodes. But our main focus for today is whey protein. So what is whey protein? Yeah, so whey protein is a byproduct of cheese making. It's the water-soluble part of milk. Now, whey protein is a high-quality, well-absorbed source of protein that's useful for reaching your daily protein intake. Now, whey protein also aids in muscle growth and fat metabolism in conjunction with a low-calorie diet and some exercise. Now, the different types of whey protein is as follows. You get the concentrate, which is a first-level refined whey. The lower end of it is 3% quality brew, but the higher end is 90%. That's what we want. Then you get the isolate. It's next level of refined whey. It contains 90% of pure whey protein, has less fat, carbs, and lactose. <laughs> then you have the hydrolysate. Now that's the purest form of whey. Huh? It's easy to digest and contains about 28% more insulin than the other two forms of whey. Yeah, so now that you know what whey protein is all about, you've got the different types of one, as I mentioned. The oscillate, hydrolysate, and concentrate. Now, the oscillate and the hydrolysate are the two top ones you want to consider. But sometimes it's too expensive to buy whey protein. Right? You go overseas, the brands there are like, you know, over a thousand rand for a bottle, but not all of us can afford something like that. That's why USN and other local brands give you economical stuff, you know. So, uh, yeah, this one you can catch around about just under 500 rand from the for leading pharmacies, like Diskem and all these other places there. But this can got some pretty quality prices at, especially when they have those three for two specials. Now, you want to consider like, you know, maybe getting bang for your buck. So this is bang for your buck. You also get the hardcore whey GH. That's got your uh, uh, creatine and your tribulus, uh, testosterone boosters, all of those things. That's value for money. Huh? So that's good stuff. And then we also got the comparison. So I thought about it. Like, I love chocolate flavor. Bar one, you get the text flavor. And you get the vanilla, strawberry, rocky road, all those different types of flavors. And it tastes nice. You know, a lot of people, they like to choose uh, a nice tasting whey protein just after their post work. And now I like to have my whey protein after I train. So I train fasted cardio. Now you must be wondering, look at this guy. He's like pop, bro. Not looking like a, but let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, guys. Look at this picture. God damn. Now that picture was of me. When I was in high school, I lost 43 kgs in six months. This is a picture of me. One year later. Yeah, so I can tune you about health, bro. Anyways, this is a picture of me at my peak. <laughs> yeah, let's check it out. Now I can tune you the facts, bro. Anyway, so we're going to be doing a comparison with different whey proteins. So we got the USN one. And we got the NPL anabolic whey all in one. Right. And nougat flavor. Is it nougat? 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 I don't know. 1.8 kg. Like this one here was value, bro. This was 2.4 kgs. And this is 1.8. But this one costs 449 rand. All right. But you also get a pre workout. This is the Natra Rush Ultra Concentrated 20 servings pre workout, bro. Now for both of this. Now, if you work it out, this one here goes by itself in the store for over 220 bucks per. So you think about it, you're paying 200 rand for the whey protein for 1.8 kilos. That's a deal and a half, bro. Now, I love my bargain spree. So if you're looking at e economic cool kind of purchases, this is the one to go for. But the only difference is, right, the protein content. Now, a serving of this, is 32 grams, but each gram, I mean, each serving got about 23.1 grams of protein, right? Now, overall, 100 grams contains 72.1 grams of protein in the blue lab. Then we got the NPL. It says here, 
One serving is 43 grams and contains 27 grams of protein. So you finish this bottle up quicker than this one if this was 1.8 kilos of rum. And this got 62.8 grams of protein per 100 grams. But that's not all. You are getting less protein, but you're getting bang for your buck with this because each serving also contains 8.6 grams of HGH volumizing stacks. So what does that mean? It's got over almost 7 grams, well, almost 3 grams, well, 3 grams of creatine monohydrate per serving, L-glycine 3 grams, taurine 2.5 grams, and ZMA, uh, which is your zinc, magnesium, and I can't remember the A, what it stands for. A spartate, I think it is. We'll find out later, right? But anyways, this is a good blend, bro. This is very good blend. So it's all about how much you're willing to spend. Both are quality proteins. This has got a pre-workout. This got your 1.8 nougat flavor, and it's got your H8 volumizing stack. And this one here is quality. It's got your oscillate, your hydrolysate, and also got your concentrate. So it all depends on you what you want at the end of the day, how much money you're willing to spend. So that's our story now for whey protein and yeah tune in next time to we'll talk about other stuff with regards to fitness and training and different supplements what you should buy what you shouldn't buy and what are the essential stuff you're going to buy as well i know it's corona time now so not all of us are like making the gains that we want but we want the gyms to come open so tell uncle cyril to open the gyms bro. until next time you're watching the review brew with myself bro. it's john up check you guys later make those gains make those pumps may have more plates more dates ha! over a night. Oh yeah, right. Don't forget, guys. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share the video with your friends and your mates. And just like us on the social media platforms. Easy as one, two, three. And if you're on YouTube, hit the bell notification for more videos to come. Right. Hey, review brew. Ha!